Okay, guys, so I have two monsters here on the star hinge, and they're both muted. I have no idea what they sound like. So look, today we're going to be awakening those two monsters, and then we're going to be getting this new monster right here. While we're here, let's just go ahead and take our free roll. Oh, we took an L there. But yeah, I'll probably just pay the diamonds to get the rest of the rolls through. That way we can get all three of these new monsters in this video today. Okay, before I awaken these guys, I want to know what their names are. Guys, if you're curious how I have these monsters but don't know what they sound like, I played Dawn of Fire for a while now, and I knew I was supposed to do something with those free rolls so i just recently figured out what this island is actually about and how there's like a new monster every like 18 days or something like that so whatever anyways we have scar guitar here and it looks like he's got some kind of like guitar or banjo i don't know what that is and then this guy i love this design by the way these guys are getting very creative with this atmos at Ad 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 <laughs> i'm not really sure what he's about but we're about to find out all right let's go ahead and start with unmuting this guy first and hearing what this guitar is gonna sound like oh Okay, wait, he's got like a wind-blowing flute sound, too. Oh, that's coming from the guitar. I can see the little hole there. Y'all hear that? Interesting, guys. Okay. If I'm not mistaken, I think you guys actually like this island. I have no idea, like, what it's gonna sound like, but I know it's hard to get the monsters. So let's go ahead and hear what this second guy sounds like. Oh, he's a singer! Sabadumbum. He's playing like an invisible guitar. Y'all see that? He's like strumming, but there's no guitar there, but we're getting the sound. Wow, how interesting, dude. I'm not really sure what I think about this island, guys. We have these cool designs. Like, it looks like this island's like floating in the air with all these gears and things just turning. And then right off the bat, we have this guy just playing an invisible guitar. So I don't know. It looks like this island is going to have a lot of plot twists on it. What is this like telescope? Oh, wait, is this the stargazer? Okay, it is, it is. Okay, I tell you what, let's go ahead and pay for our rolls here. And let's see if we can get this next monster. I don't know who that's gonna be. We got two stars there. W Riz. Okay, so we're that much closer. We only have three slots to go. And again, you can see the egg of the monster that we're aiming to get here. And I'm not sure what his name is or what he's gonna sound like. Again, I'm still learning when it comes to this prism gate and all this stuff going on here. I'm not the most educated when it comes to Dawn of Fire, so I definitely have a lot to learn. Guys, if y'all wanna help me out in the comment section below, I'll be reading the comments. So please feel free to do that because I could use the help. Bro, we're getting no stars here, dude. Like, thanks for the diamonds, but bro, we're getting zero luck. Okay, there we go. We finally got a star there to move forward. Perfect. And we're that much closer, guys. So, guys, I'm confused. After I do get this guy achieved, is it gonna give me a new star chart to get another monster? Because I see up there, it says Core of Flame, seven days remaining. So, will I get a new chart, or is it gonna make me wait until the seven days is over to get another chart? I don't really know. We're just gonna keep spinning this regardless here. Okay, it looks like we are on the last slot. Do we have to get one more? Oh my gosh, dude. I thought it was gonna give me the last one. Okay, here we go. Maybe we can get lucky here. We got two stars, so it looks like we're gonna be completing the chart. Oh my gosh, dude. Such a cool design. And where do we place him, guys? I don't know. This is my first time doing this live in a video. Okay, let's just place this monster right here. Oh my gosh. Wait, I didn't know it did that. Holy cow, that was sick. And this design looks insane. Okay, wait, wait. Let's just, let's just hear what this guy sounds like. Oh, he's a drummer. Oh my gosh, guys. He's playing this with like some flaming sticks. Uh. Yo, when he be go, could you know what? Oh, dang. I was about to go crazy. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. His drumming sound was very good there. That's one of my favorite drummers I've heard with a monster. I know we hit on this earlier, guys, but I have to mention it. They just go crazy for the designs on this island, man. Like, these are very intricately made monsters with these cool styles. All these, like, different unique things. Like, this dude is literally like an oven with a neck of a chimney. And then he's got, like, this big mustache. <laughs> Holy cow, dude. They killed it. Okay, wait. So now we're going to go ahead and see if our theory was incorrect. Let's go look at the gaze here. And wait, it actually gives us a new one. Wait, is it for the same monster though? No! Did I just... Okay, oh my gosh. I thought I bought him by accident. Dude, that would have been... Oh my gosh, that would have been horrible. But okay, guys, so it looks like we're gonna have to wait until the seven-day timer is over until we can get our next monster moving in motion, which is cool. I'm perfectly fine with that. This is our first episode doing anything on the Star Hinge, so I am perfectly fine with that. But okay, guys, while we're on Dawn of Fire, we have some more things that we need to do. Smoochly has actually been added to Dawn of Fire, as you can see here. And oh my gosh, y'all have been so mad at me for not getting her. So don't worry, we're gonna get her 
her right now before she leaves the market. And the requirements for this breed are going to be Riff, along with Tweedle. And guys, I don't think we have Tweedle here. It looks like we're going to have to go purchase her again. Thankfully, it's only 300 gold, which as you guys can see, we can afford that. I don't know how I have so much right now, guys. Let's go ahead and place her down. And I'm hoping I have some food here. Let me see. Okay, we have a little bit. This should get her to level four pretty quickly. Yeah, okay, that, that'll work. <laughs> so there we go. You're welcome, Tweedle. I know, you're celebrating. All right, guys, and now let's go to the breeding structure and let's throw... Oh, wait, he's level one. Okay, hold up. We gotta get Riff leveled up as well. Oh, he might be a little bit harder to get leveled up too. We just need him to get to level four. Come on, come on. Oh my gosh, he's so close. Okay, um, is he gonna like ice cubes? I don't know. Does Riff like that? Uh, a little bit. Okay, at least enough to get him to level four. That'll work for now. There we go. Oh, wait, we have our solo right here. Where's our boy at? <laughs> Bro, he's like our depressing monster for the island. He's kind of like how Nightbear is for Ethereal Workshop. That's what he is for Dawn of Fire. All right, guys, let's throw these two in together. I'm not sure how long this is gonna take. I've never bred a seasonal on Dawn of Fire now that I think of this it. This is actually my first seasonal monster ever for this game, which is pretty exciting, guys. Sadly, we did not get our first try, but it's okay. Dawn of Fire, normally they make it pretty simple to get these breeds, so I think we might get her here. Three, oh, nope, I was completely wrong. We got another Tweedle. It's okay, though, guys. If this game has taught me anything, it has taught me to become a patient man. I am okay with not getting our breed right off the bat, because I know with time and patience, we will eventually get him. Look at that. Look at that, baby! 24-hour wait time, you already know- Just when I think this game is on my side. They do me wrong, man. Everything I said about patience, forget all of that. I take it all back, dude. I just want the monster. Another 24 hour. It's gonna be another riff, man. Gosh darn it! And this is gonna blow through our diamonds. How much is this gonna cost me, dude? 96 diamonds to speed that up. Holy fudge. Okay, it is what it is. You know what? We're just gonna have a bunch of riffs right in this corner. They're just gonna be hanging out over there. You guys just y'all throw a party or something. Everyone at home watching the video, cross the fingers for this breed. Here we go. Let's see if we can get smoochly. Come on. No! Oh, wait. No. Oh, guys, look, as you can see, I was basing my breed off this. And you can say, unlike the original game where Smoochly is bred with Riff and Tweedle, Smoochly is instead bred with Taiwa and Kana. Oh my god! Bro, I didn't read it correctly. It literally said, unlike the original game, meaning don't do this. Do this instead. And I only read the front because I'm not patient. Oh my, this, this video just took a whole loop on me, huh? <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and get this Tweedle out of our nursery here. And now that we know the correct breed, let's... Let's see if we can get this. Okay, so it's Taiwa and Kana, and please tell me we have both of these. Oh, no. Dude, I don't think we have Taiwa. We don't have Taiwa, do we? No, dude, we don't. Oh, my gosh, bro. Guys, I've been doing a lot of teleporting on this game, moving monsters from the continent over to other islands, and I just haven't replenished Taiwa yet, apparently. So I think we're gonna have to rebreed her somehow. And what is she? Where's she even at, bro? Oh, my gosh. She's all the way down here. Are you joking me? Ah, she's a four element. Okay, one second. How to breed... Tiowa, Dawn of Fire. There we go. Noggin and Wink. Okay, do we have Noggin and Wink here? Yes, okay, we have Wink. Okay, perfect. There he is. And I'm assuming we have Noggin. If not, that's an easy fix right here. Oh, yeah, there he is. Sorry, I didn't see baby Noggin right there. Okay, and let me make sure they're both they're not leveled up. Okay. Let's give some bamboo over to Noggin. Get him up to level four here. There we go. I got you, broski. And Wink, he is he looks like a level. Oh, he's leveled up. Okay. I'm sorry, Wink. I misjudged you, bro. Now let's throw these two in together here. And then we should be able to get Tiowa. And then after we get Tiowa, we should be able to get our breed for Smoochly to finally get him on the island. Wow, dude. It's so interesting how videos like this can just turn out to be way longer than you originally expected. That's what makes Dawn of Fire interesting, though, guys. We learned some life lessons from this game, man. Noggin, get the fudge off my island. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and run this back. Come on, game. Please give me a tie over here. Four minute wait time. Once again, we got another fudge and Noggin, dude. Oh, man, this game is actually testing me today. It's all good, guys. You know, at the end of the day, we love my singing monsters. So really, we're just getting a longer video. We get to spend more time together. See, guys, you just gotta change your perspective to look at the positive of the situation. Yup, it's that time of the video. <sighs> Here we go, man. Just take my money, man. Just take my money. Yeah, I know you're happy, Kana. You're welcome. It'd be nice if you guys could give me a little bit of luck here. I just spent like 800 diamonds trying to get this breed. I don't know why this is so difficult. If I don't get it this time, I'm just gonna go buy her from the shop straight up. Yep, and we got a noggin. Okay, well, you guys know what that means. I could just buy smoochly. Or I don't care. I don't care. I do not care. I've spent way too many diamonds for no reason on this video. I could have just bought Smoochly from the first place. Whatever, dude. We finally got her. Let's place her down now and hear what she sounds like. Oh. Yo, they have a really hoppish voice. Oh, she's actually singing. Bum, 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 bum. Hit that Smoochly. Yo. 
I was not expecting them to actually sing there. Wow, that was awesome. You can definitely tell that's like a baby voice of Smoochly there. It's like super, super high pitch. But I think it went along with the melody really well there. If you would like for me to come back to Dawn of Fire more often, then let me know down in the comment section below.